It's a story we bring you weekly, car thefts, and unfortunately those numbers are up across the Bluff City. Officials warning people to be extra careful and take precautions, especially around the holidays. But there's also work being done by Memphis police to try and make a difference. This week, officers from the Appling Farms Precinct passed out wheel locks to drivers. WRG's Shay Arthur is live tonight with how a chance encounter Shay is helping one woman fill us in. Mm -hmm. Hey, Stephanie. Well, you, of course, know the saying being kind to a stranger can pay off. But in this case, it can provide some protection, too. <laughs> <laughs> Memphis police officers Christopher Smith and Kenesha Washington laugh like their old friends with Doris Jones. But the three just met yesterday. The officers were wrapping up a call off Germantown Parkway when they saw Miss Jones. She works in the floral department at Kroger. I saw Miss uh, Miss Jones uh, had a big old smile. Uh, very pleasant um, aura about her. She said, uh, Merry Christmas. I said, Merry Christmas back. Uh, she said, be careful. Ms. Jones says she didn't think too much of the comment. In the Alba official, you know, we try to be nice. We say, have a, be careful, Merry Christmas. And it was just, but we don't. But that wasn't the end of the conversation. We had been tasked uh, this, uh, earlier that morning in roll call to try to spread the word and get awareness out on, on motor vehicle thefts. Smith's colonel had given officers a wheel lock, just like these and a holiday card to give to someone in the community. In the seconds it takes to say Merry Christmas, Smith found his person. I asked her what kind of car she drove, yeah. and she, <laughs> she said an old one. Miss Jones uh, just inspired me to, to want to do it, so I asked her to step outside with us uh, without, without handcuffs, right, uh, by her own free will. I was shocked. I mean, I know I didn't do anything wrong, but for somebody just to go out and tell you, come here once <laughs> you know. The officers showed Miss Jones how to use the wheel lock and snapped a selfie. Jones saying she's thankful to the officers. Oh my goodness, yes, yes. For Officer Washington, it was her first day on the job. She's now inspired. As I was telling her earlier, you know, it did make us feel, you know, proud, and especially for her because with mm -hmm. so much going on, you know, we mm -hmm. want to bring positive things. Positive acts they hope to continue. I just felt really good. Yeah. You know, she made me feel real good and inspired, uh, inspired me to want to act. We just have a lot of victims, you know, in the city, yeah. and if we can do just a little bit to try to lessen the number, then that's, that's what we can do. A nice story to be able to share tonight. And Stephanie MPD tells us they are working to get more wheel locks. And as soon as they can set up another giveaway, we'll be sure to let you know. We're live in Cordova tonight. Shay Arthur, WREG News Channel 3. It's a good story, Shay. And that officer has a sense of humor, too. <laughs> Thank you.